Spike Lee's latest film, Black KK Klansman, is part of his constant battle against racism. Set in the 1970s, Black KK Klansman is based on a real-life story. Hello, this is Ron Stallworth calling. Well, who am I speaking with? This is David Duke. Grand Wizard of the Ku Klux Klan. That David Duke? God. Last time I checked. What can I do you for? Well, since you asked, I hate blacks. I hate Jews, Mexicans, and Irish. Italians and Chinese. But my mouth to God's ears, I really hate those black rats. A black police officer infiltrates the Ku Klux Klan, white supremacist organization in the United States. John David Washington stars as the undercover black police agent. Adam Driver plays his secular Jewish sidekick. Together they thwart a KKK plot against a black power movement. Lee doesn't shy away from using the real life name of Ron Stallworth, the black police officer. Neither does he shy away from using the name of David Duke, the real life leader of the KKK. Adding substance to the film, Lee also uses real life footage of the Charlottesville race riots last year in the US. Lee would win the prize for the most politically incorrect scenario if there were one. His film is not anti any color, creed or religion. It's anti-racism and it's against anti-Semitism. It's against fueling hatred. White power! Black power! Knights of the Ku Klux Klan. That's us. Stalworth Brothers. We're on a roll, baby. Black KK Klansman is also right on in inventing strong roles for women and black actors. But that's not all. Another reason to recommend the film is that the music is foot-tapping good. America first. America first. America first. If I would have known this was a clan, I wouldn't have taken this mother. 